Greetings and salutations. Welcome to Tarot Hard. Where we tarot hard with tarot cards with yours truly. The Tarot Bard. Thank you for joining me in beginning a brand new trilogy. This time it's dedicated to the Zodiac who would be most likely to bring a knife to a gunfight and somehow still manage to win. Aries. You know the same old song and dance. The Zodiac prediction reading will be divided into three parts. A clarity reading, a connection reading, and a crescent reading. This will be the clarity reading part. But first, a word about our Lord and Savior. Aries. Born between March 21st and April 19th. Your avatar is a ram with magnificent curling horns. And even though you look like a lamb you are far from it. You are no one's follower. You are a natural born leader of men. Trailblazers and mavericks. You can play nice with others but generally you're a stoic rebel and a proud person. No one can make you feel ashamed of yourself. The only person who can make you feel bad about you is only you. And that quiet confidence is what sets you apart from everyone around you. When set out to do something, be it a job or a hobby, not only do you perfect your task, but you also go the extra mile to either do what no one has ever tried, or to add that special flair or touch, to make your task stand out. Just like you, all that you do, has a certain gene sacquois. Je ne sais quoi. Je ne sais quoi. Je ne sais quoi. Personne n'échappe à mon regard. Sorry about that. That joke was lame. I should have known that I can't pull the wool over your eyes. Now I'm feeling sheepish. Okay. Enough puns. On to the clarity reading. The first card is the overall situation. The ones beneath are the contributing factors. Nine of cups. Victory. Happiness. The gods smile upon you. Or vice versa. A feeling of fulfillment overtakes you. This generally comes from good service to your community and family. As well so the blessings in your life. You've got it made. Now. The contributing factors. The livers. This arcana is closely associated with the Gemini Zodiac and as its name suggests has to do with love and everything it entails a special someone could be about to waltz into your life or an already existing relationship is about to go to a whole new level the presence of this card could be suggesting the presence of an unexpected situation in which heart and mind will come to conflict in that case we suggest you follow your heart you won't regret any decision if it was made out of love Next. Four of Wands. Happiness. Family. Surprises. Well. Everything's coming up Millhouse. Be proud of your achievements, because success is in the cards. Family and friends have never been closer. Your business will boom. And you're healthier than the people I have locked up in my basement. Good things are on their way. Six of Swords. It's time for a change of scenery. And who can blame you, when all that woman and those guys on the boat, can see our Six Swords stacked up like that. Anyway, there was a previous situation in which a resolution had been far from at hand. But some good news. Because that's how you air is roll. There's going to be a grace period in which some stress will be lifted off you. Seize this moment to take a short break, or go on vacation. A step back may give you better perspective on the situation. It's best to set your engine in neutral and just slow down and smell the roses. Aries are generally hard workers and they need their rest just like everybody else. 
No one will fault you for needing a break. So, sit back and relax. That was all for today. See you next time, where we'll explore the ties that bind four good old Aries. Till then. Stay enlightened. Je ne sais quoi. Sasquatch has...